All right, so a little more. <laughs> okay, uh, where do I start? Okay, so this is this uh, velocity or this speed thing is just the velocity tab for this polygon right here, which tells me uh, how fast it's going. This thruster is our drill. This is gonna provide the downward force. Gravity is turned off, so there is no gravity. Um, and air friction on or off doesn't really matter. Uh, it doesn't make a difference because these are 10 times above scale, um, but they should be 10 times scale, I guess. Uh, so yeah, so this is I guess what we're looking at here. If I let this go, this does have a bottom plate. We will see the chain fountain propagate. And this simulation is slowed down so that we can see it. Also because my computer is slowing it down because it can't handle it very fast, but we see it propagate pretty high. pretty high. And I believe even at the end we're going to get a little whip effect that's going to snap the chain. Right there. Yep, there goes a piece. Okay. So now let's do the same thing with the bottom plate deleted. We will get no propagation of the chain fountain and you'll see Gravity is not pulling these down. These are going down based off of the lever effect, which is pushing against the item beneath it. So momentum of these is allowing it to propagate a little bit, but it will these will eventually be saturated with enough energy to the point that they're moving down and there is no lever effect anymore. And no chain fountain. So I guess we'll let it play all the way out. Just pulling over the side of the barrier now. We're going to get a little whip effect there that's going to snap the chain a little bit. Oh, no. Oh, yep, there's a snap right there. All right. So, but again, with this, it works. So what I wanted to see, we can look at appearance, visualize forces on this. Why are you showing me those? Algodoo is kind of buggy sometimes. Um, well, here, let's go appearance. Uh, oh my goodness, there, okay, turn it off for everything, turn it on for just this, or you like this. All right, well, we'll keep it for a second, let's see what happens. All right, so there's your downward force. Keep in mind that this is, everything is to a scale of 10, and it's probably even more screwed up than that, honestly, because... I don't know what I'm doing as far as I'll do perfectly. But here's your downward force, and that's being exerted by mainly this object, and this object, and this object. And we kind of lose it for a little bit. The chain fountain kind of loses some altitude, and then we gain it back again. So there's your lever effect. And there's a little piece of chain going off flying in the distance there. Okay.